Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the capital city of Kenya is uh, Brenner. It's coming. <laughs> the look. Oi, boa tarde. Meu nome é Breno. Breno. You know, I always ask, what do you know about? So, what do you guys know about Kenya? Yeah. Uh, Brenner? It's coming. <laughs> it's a lot. Okay, Kenya, uh, it's one of the populated country in Africa. <laughs> okay. It, it's a really populated. And it's a really developed country. Like the, uh, I know that there are cities like Mombasa, which is really beautiful. I watched the travel vlog. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, about Mombasa. They have really good beaches. Kenya is in the middle of Africa? Kenya is right south of Ethiopia. So it's like it's like central. It's like central but east. Yeah. We say we're East Africa. We don't say we're Central East. We say East. Uh -huh. Exactly. Do you have the savannas? Yeah, we have the savannas. Yeah. We have the savannas. Mm -hmm. uh, the so climate's yeah. about the same as uh, I think some of your countries. The capital city of Kenya is. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, I, I knew it. I knew it. The capital of your country, it's real. No! Wait, I knew. I knew this. I knew it's a capital city, but I forgot. But I know that Kenya, in Kenya, they speak in Swahili. Yeah, okay. okay. <laughs> I know that. Uh, I know the, cap the capital of your country is Bishkek. <laughs> uh, I know that. Okay. <laughs> then the, ca the capital city of Kenya is. Oh god! <laughs> <Yeah>. Cape Town? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, okay, okay. okay. Uh, Tashkent, and then yeah. Rio, okay. Rio, Brazilian. It used to be Rio de Janeiro. Mm -hmm. Tashkent. What's the capital? You don't know? I forgot! You don't know? I forgot! What? I forgot! What? I forgot! Man! It's I... Nairobi! Ah! Nairobi! Nairobi! Nairobi. Like the, the woman. Sorry, sorry. The woman you will cut it. You will cut this part. <laughs> I don't know if you guys have watched this. The one where there... Money. What's it called? The one where there's Nairobi, Tokyo, there are colonels, and they steal yeah. money. What's yeah. it? What's the TV show? Uh... Bella Ciao, Cas Casa de Pape. Casa de Pape. Uh, There's Nairobi there. Huh? They're yeah. all named after cities. One of them is named Nairobi. Huh? I never watched it. You never watched it? No, I think you watched it. Maybe it's different. It, it might be. It might have a different title than that. It's a Casa de Pape. Yeah. yeah. No, but I never watched it. Oh, you never watched it? Yeah, no, it's a good one. I never watched it. Because uh, 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 I heard that the, the ending is quite not nice, so I didn't watch it. I mean, it did it end? Yet. And not yet. It's not, not yet. yet. It's not yet. Uh, I mean, think the story's okay. If you want to just pass the time. It's, <laughs> not, it's not Game of Thrones, to be honest. It's not like... Game but there's of something movie. interesting. Like, but it is. It is. You should check it out if you have to. Like, during programming, you can just put the next <laughs> screen. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Watch it. <laughs> okay. Okay. okay, so you guys don't know much about my country. Man, why do I know so much? Why? I said that... Nairobi is the capital city. I said Mombasa is a beautiful city. <laughs> Why do you think that I don't know about Kenya? They speak okay. in Swahili. Yeah, okay. okay. Kenya is one of the most developed countries. Like they have highest, higher G highest GPA in GDP in the uh, East and Central. Yeah. Okay. Actually, that might be. But then, in terms of HDI, maybe we're the, the top. We're okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We're, we're you guys okay. do. Great. It's not like super developed, but it's okay. Uh, I wouldn't say super developed. Mm -hmm. And he's actually selling my country more than I am. <laughs> <laughs> uh, thanks, Tilo. Thanks, Tilo. Just uh, for, the, for the Kenyan people. <laughs> camera, behind cameras, he becomes super racist. <laughs> <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Um, we've already talked about your individual countries. And Brazil. Sorry, but I watched the soccer video. <laughs> <Good job. laughs> <laughs> uh, in Brazil, it's just the soccer players in yeah. one country. Uh, soccer and carnival? Uh, carnival, yeah. Carnival, carnival, I watch. It's really beautiful. Yeah. I, I want to attend. Yeah, but but I, honestly, for some reason, I didn't know that Brazil had so many people who are Afro. 
sent no, yeah, no. like before then I found out later what's the official language? Portuguese yeah. only Portuguese we don't have like native language uh, okay. what about the Amerindians? yeah they just we don't talk about that. It's sad, 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 sad stuff. Ah, it's sad stuff. No, most people like don't even care. After after part like the American language, mm -hmm. you know, the most common. Mm -hmm. Not the most common, like more, most speakers. I think it's Tupigo or anything. Okay. Because I uh, no, I, because actually a lot of like food mm -hmm. or places are from this language. Uh, uh, but I don't know. No, nobody. Nobody. Actually, nobody. Wait, how many languages do you speak? Yeah, that's what I wanted to ask. Yeah. Okay, now uh, Portuguese in English. Uh, Portuguese yeah, fluent. Okay. But I, I studied a little bit of German. Okay. Oh. And Korean. Okay. 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 Yeah, that's good. And Tibo? Russian? No, English? Okay. Uh, Uzbek? Uzbek, yeah. <laughs> and uh, Korean a little bit. Mm. And a little bit Turkish, maybe. Okay. Turkish. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Uh, English slightly fluently, a little bit of Korean. And then, I don't know for some reason, I was fucking. English, yeah, I said English, sorry. Oh, okay. <laughs> and then I said, uh, I said English, sorry. A little bit of green. Uh, yeah. Sometimes I didn't understand some French, but not. Oh, oh I guess I did. You can understand Spanish? Oh, wait, one second. Is it different from Portuguese, like Portugal Portuguese ah, and uh, the Brazil uh, Portuguese? Uh, like, uh, the grammar is the same, mm -hmm. but you can see like the accent is super different. Okay. And uh, there's some more, like there's some grammatical stuff that Portuguese still uses that Brazil no one uses. Mm. So you can easily understand yeah. yeah. like American and British English. Yes, yeah, pretty basic. Okay. Yes. No. Okay. So say, can you say something in Portuguese yeah. that what? I? <laughs> what do you want to say? Introduce yourself. Let's say. Oi, boa tarde. Meu nome é Breno. Breno. Curso de ciência da computação okay. e eu tô, eu tô estudando aqui na Coreia University por um ano, assim, por, como, como aluno de intercâmbio. Wow, it looks, yeah. it listens nice, like uh, that European language, you know, like French, mm -hmm. like Spanish mm -hmm. and Portuguese type. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good. Mm -hmm. Those are the romance language. Yeah. 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 I think people that doesn't know Portuguese think that I'm speaking Spanish or French. Exactly. Yeah. That's what I heard. Yeah, 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 that's what I heard. <laughs> that's like I heard French and Spanish in the yeah. middle. <laughs> I said, you know, Spanish is more like na 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 na, and then Portuguese, uh, da na 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 na. I feel like, and then French is like bonjour. Like it's very French is like where you meet something, <laughs> and then what you see is not what you're eating. No, but in Portuguese, it's kind of the same because I was like. Uh, yeah, teaching some Portuguese from mm. my friends, mm. and like I was reading like uh, some text, and like mm. yeah, like we write this way, but like in the end we pronounce different, or in the middle it's different. Oh. Yeah, and like yeah, we have like some. Oh, yeah. I think yeah, almost every language has oh, this. So. Okay. Because no, no, French is, is another. French language. is like extra. The one thing that also characterizes the language is like the N H O. Like mm -hmm. it's not Ronaldinho, Ronaldinho, it's Ronaldinho. Ronaldinho. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ronaldinho. Yeah. 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 And then introduce yeah. yourself in Uzbek. Yeah, exactly. What do you want me to say? Mm -hmm. Introduction. Mm -hmm. Hello, my name is Tilo. I study at Korean Day or... Okay. Salam, my name is Mamur Ahmadullah. I'm in Korea University of Computer Science University of Okay. Yeah. Salam. I understood salam because it's, it's like hi. Yeah. It's and uh, I said like, my name is Rahmatullah, mm -hmm. and I study computer science mm -hmm. in, in my language, Korea University. In my language, salam is the literal reading. Mm -hmm. We we could say salam, but then we would say we would be literally meaning greetings. I don't know how to explain it. Uh -huh. So we don't say salam. We would say I send my greetings. Then we would use salam, mm -hmm. and then we say salam. Mm -hmm. Because in my language, we cannot end in a consonant. Oh, we have to end in a, in a vowel. Uh, that's why we turn shukran into shukrani. Okay. Uh, some errors. Yeah. Uh, yeah. My language, I keep introducing myself in my language. Mm -hmm. But like, one thing that I get here, mm -hmm. 
It's like when I don't know, like I, I met some African people in my door, mm. and like some some of them like have a really like strong accent from Africa. Oh, I, I, I don't have the African accent. Yeah, no, yeah, I don't have it. Yeah. Oh. It's really like uh, you know the stereotypes. Yeah. Yeah, it's like it is like that. Yeah, what yeah, 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 Because yeah. I live in the dormitory. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. What? what you don't have is? that sound. Right? I do yeah. yeah. not sound like that. You don't I have that yeah. African sound. Yeah. Because, yeah. because I went to a super American school, like I've even when you speak African language, the Kenyan language, like Swahili, you don't, you don't sound like that. Oh, Swahili has no insane accent. Mm-hmm. That's what I try to teach people. Uh-huh. I had a friend. You know, remember he had a mutual friend, and I used to try to teach him to pronounce it. Mm-hmm. So I teach him to say mambo. He says mambo in the most African stereotypical way possible. And I'm like, you don't say it like that. So I think mambo. Try mambo. 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 You yeah. said it. Yeah. So I think isn't about over emphasizing how it's not like Korean where you have to sound Korean. <laughs> yeah, okay. Or Japanese or yeah. like Portuguese or like it's not like that. We do have our sounds, but if you say it calmly, you will say it perfectly. It's read as you say. Uh, so, mambo, naito mengi, natoka kani. It's like that. Well, then the way Ngoi would speak it, like, uh, it's like you would say something like mambo. No, no, no. He would also say it like me, but then in a more Tanzanian way. Ah, how do I explain this? It's hard. It's it's so hard to explain. It is what he said. He said African sound. No, 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 yeah. no. That is nothing. When when Tanzanians speak Swahili. It's not, I only have one issue with their Swahili. They mix the L with the R. Mm-hmm. That's it. But there it's actually better than mine. Oh. It's more native. It's more proper. Uh, mm-hmm. it's, it's more proper. Mm-hmm. It's more proper uh, to speak like them than to speak like me, for example. Okay. But the best accent is a Mombasa accent. You know that's it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Then they have the best Swahili accent. It's not like Dar es Salaam, it's not like Nairobi. Nairobi is too... modernized. It's too... yeah. Mombasa is the best way to mm-hmm. Dar, Dar es Salaam, they mix the L and the R. I, I, honestly, it's confusing. Uh, when I want to say something like uh, the corporal, they say kupro, kupro. They say the corporal, kupro, and then it's supposed to be kupro. Right? Mm-hmm. So when they say, when they mix the L and the R, when you're writing it down and you don't know how to speak the language, you write L and then it's supposed to be R. Uh-huh. How, how is R <laughs> supposed to understand? No, but I think this happens in every It doesn't happen. Even in Portuguese, in Portuguese, in Brazil, like they have like different mm-hmm. regions mm-hmm. and different accents mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. different ways to pronounce this mm-hmm. word. Mm-hmm. And like there's a lot of joke. Mm-hmm. Um, so, like, mm-hmm. Uh, more like in Rio, mm-hmm. they say like Ishkeiro, mm-hmm. Ishkima, mm-hmm. and like in, like in São Paulo, they say like uh, Isqueiro, mm-hmm. Isquina. Uh-huh. So, like, uh, or like G, I say like G in the end, like G. And like normally it's like they. No, but then honest, if you guys are learning as Swahili, do not learn using the Nairobi accent and also do not learn using the Dar es Salaam. I'm not even hating, I just think Mombasa is the best. Because if with Nairobi, you will not get to proper Swahili. Mm-hmm. You will learn to mix the language, <laughs> and you will learn a bunch of things that are not useful. With Dar es Salaam, you sometimes will be like, oh, is that an L or is it an R? Is it an L? It's, it will confuse you. Okay. But Mombasa, best. Uh, that's what I would recommend for most people. Now, we've spoken for so long. Yeah, it's more like a podcast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a podcast, man. <laughs> One hour, we're gonna, we're gonna cut that. Money. What's that, what's that called? The one where there's Nairobi.